shaving your hair is a ritual cleansing and letting go a destiny we have shown how extensively brainwashed the human race is if you dare to shave your hair for a cause that is best for all then immediately you are branded as some form of evil the only thing you're really doing is standing and presenting yourself as a visual advert to show and to state that you pledge your life to bring about a world that's best for all. So we have decided as a group that one will no longer shave your hair continuously unless you would want to. I shave my hair continuously because I use it as a cleansing. That means I let go of everything of the day and shave it off. It works extensively well. I've been doing it for many, many, many years. It's very effective and a very cool letting go. We will still have a once a year shaving to confirm our pledge to a world that's best for all. But we suggest that if you are getting flack just for shaving your head, it's worthwhile to shave your head at least once to see what attachments you have and what forgivenesses are, re are really necessary. It's not so simple to just imitate the point. It is effective to actually do it. Once you've done that, then there's no point to keep on agitating all the brainwashed people around you. Grow your hair again because once a year we'll do it, we'll agitate them once a year, we'll shave our hair and we'll be bold and in their face confirming the pledge to a world that is best for all and then we will do it again. So it doesn't matter what we look like, how we look like and what we have to do, we will get done what must be done, a world that's best for all. This is going to take everything that we could muster as ourselves. But those of you that do keep on shaving, you'll find that there is ways that one can do it that is very supportive. Thus do it as such. If you grow your hair, work at utilizing substances and washing your hair and so on that do not contaminate extensively or is part of the greater beauty consumption thing. Focus on effective living as far as possible. It's not always possible, but as much as you can do. For those of you that have shaved your heads in standing and pledging your life for what is best for all as equality and oneness, thank you for your support. You are supporting yourself and through supporting yourself you are supporting everyone else and together as a group we will inv in inevitably bring about a world that's best for all. It may take many years but it is inevitable. Remain dedicated realizing that as a group is the only way we're going to do this. That is why they are dividing people into groups against each other. There is this constant war, whether it is cultural, whether it is economic, whether it is religious. It's a constant war going on. Instead of having a principle that actually bind everyone together as one and as equal, there is division. Divide and conquer. Therefore humanity as this divided groups can go nowhere. We need one combined point where everyone stand together 
for what's best for all. And that is why we are standing. So join us if you grasp this. Obviously the one fascinating thing is that those that are consumed with ego cannot stand for what's best for all because it is simply impossible and therefore they will try and divide you. They must because they want to be self-righteous. That's the whole point of ego instead of being the self that is rightly used in a way that is best for all. Join us at Equal Money and at Destiny. And if you want to keep shaving your head like me, be with me. I love shaving. <laughs>